What's going on, everybody? See here. Oh, welcome back to some more Moon Farmer. That's right. We're back doing some more Moon Farmer prologue stuff. Of course we are, because we've got a moon to farm here, people. And we just got ourselves an amazing base that I'm super excited to start filling with all kinds of wonderful things. So, a um, couple things that I want to do. I want to get the plant incubators, incubators going. And... Um, I want to get some more of just basically everything. I want to get our whole new base outfitted with stuff. Um, I was going to go through and do the uh, the furnaces first. Because like I said, I wanted to have like three furnaces, one for everything. However, I don't know if there's like an upgraded furnace. So I don't know if I want to try that right now. I think we're going to like progress on with, this, with the, the mission a little bit. And see if we unlock anything extra. And then go from there. So um, we're going to try to get to the farming automation... And see how that goes. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. So, three plant incubators. What do we need for that? So I've got some iron here. Um, printer. Plant incubator. We need three of these. So we need iron, glass, and electrical chips for all of those. Now, I think I've got... I've probably got the iron. I don't think I have the glass or the electrical chips. Hold on. Let's see here. Um, E-chips. we got seven... And hold on, let's pull this out because that's not doing anything. Iron. Do we want to do iron right now? No. Let's actually go ahead and let's do um, let's do some glass crystals. Let's get the iron set back here. We'll get this set down here. So that way we can get... Oh, we don't have enough. Okay, never mind then. Uh, scrap that. Let's just do iron then. So we need to go out and we need to grab... Hold on, let's go through... Let's throw the e-chips into storage. So iron that. We need to go grab some glass pieces. We need to go grab some of those. Get those smelted up, and then how many e chips do we need? Two, and we need three, so two, four, six of those. We already have those. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go and grab up a whole bunch of stuff to start with. Drop this, drop everything in here, so that way we can start doing it smelty goodness. And uh, yeah, we'll be back in just a second. So we've got some things smelting away here. I think we might have enough to get a couple of these built. So let me throw the glass in there, the iron in there, and then I think we could get probably... Can we get two of these? No, just one. What am I missing? Oh, the glass panes. Yeah, because they take three per deal. Oh, whew. pricey little guys. All right, we are good. We got our first plant incubator. We'll let the uh... ah, water level's critical. Okay, we're good. Let's go see what these uh, what these things look like here. Uh, oh, airlock, of course. Always the airlock. All right, so we've got all this room to play with here. So let's go and bring this up here. How big is this one? Ooh. It's a... It's a, it's a big one. So... Right there. Okay, how does this... I'm not actually sure how this works yet. Oh. Oh, the, um, we have to place our plant deals right there are the, um, our farms right here. Oh, darn. Now I want this face in the other direction. Oh, if I destroy this, hold for build options. Can I recycle this? Upgrade, demolish, demolish this part and all the things that it supports. No, I don't want to demolish you. Oh, I want to put it long ways so then we could walk like right down the middle of all of them. Huh. You know what? That's fine. Let's do this. Let's get this one built and we'll just, we'll see what happens here. Well, it says build three of them. Now, the reason I'm curious about that is because we also have to eventually make, where are they at? Uh, the farming control panel and the storage section. So I'm kind of curious like how these all connect up. Um, I guess we're just gonna have to kind of leave it for now. We'll see how everything connects up, then we can always rebuild later. Uh, but we do need a farming pot, I think. I think we need a farming pot, but it says build three plant incubators. So I guess we'll go ahead and try to get the three plant incubators built first. Want me to explain again? Huh? Uh, no. Okay, this could be actually a happy accident. <laughs> this could very well be a happy accident. Because each... Uh, it says each foundation can hold three incubators, and once you place plant pots on the incubators, you can no longer directly interact with the plant pots. So, if I could bring this up here, then I should be able to get... Can I get a third one in here? Oh, okay, so it's going to go like that. So, actually, 
that will probably make sense. Have three there, have three there, so on and so forth. Maybe. I don't know. I want to see how the control panel hooks up, and I want to see how the storage system hooks up as well um, to kind of see, like, how spacing is going to work, how that stuff's going to work. So we got to go talk to the commander again. They're probably going to tell us to uh, go ahead and put all the six farming pots in there. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, so now we have to build a control section and a storage section. So it doesn't sound like those actually have to be connected. Um, oh, we are out of batteries. Let's get that fixed. It doesn't sound like they actually have to be connected, so we might actually be able to put as many of these as we want in here. Uh, let's go ahead and split this. Grab these batteries. Let's throw these in here. Turn that back on. Okay, so now we need the control section and a storage section. So farming control panel, iron bar, glass crystals, electrical chip. Ooh, that's expensive. Uh, iron bar. Oh, hey, we can get that one going. Turn that bad boy on. And then, so we need to get some glass crystals, three glass crystals and seven electrical chips. Okay, so let's make that happen. Well, I guess there's the glass crystals right there. Um, so we'll take that and then we are waiting for the chips. Oh, chips are so slow. So there's that. So the only thing we don't have is the chips. Okay. So let's look at this storage section here. Pull that into our inventory. Now, like I said, I don't think these actually have to be connected, which could be interesting. Now it does say that they all have to be within the same airlock structure. So storage section, if I put this in here. Oh, this literally can just go anywhere. Huh. So... We could have storage. We could have storage in here. If maybe I can get these to line up. Um... Oh, it made a few of them. Interesting. So then let's say, let's put the control section like maybe right here. I don't wish that would go right there. Um, I guess we'll just put that right there for now. Okay, so now we need to put chests so we can have another one right here so we can make one more and then we need to get the control section in here. And I believe that control section is actually just gonna control these. So we might be able to just extend these like this way and just have a ton of them in here. Oh, this looks cool. This could be neat. I was assuming that these had to be like connected. You know, I thought the, the storage was going to be connected to that. And then the control section was going to be connected to that as well. But that doesn't look like the case. So what do I need for a chest? Storage chest container iron bars. How much iron do we have in here? Oh yeah, we got plenty. Okay. So let's get, uh, let's get two of these going. We'll get one of those little things filled up. Um, and then, cause I think it said we had to have at least two in order to get everything working. So we'll get those two, we'll place those. And then we will, um, I guess we need to make some of the, the farming pots as well. Iron bars and glass crystals. Okay. So I actually don't need any more. Let's just go ahead and take those out right now. Let the silicone do its thing. Each chip and silicone pan or glass panel. Grab those out, grab that. We're at four, we need seven total. And then let's go ahead and get some plant incubators. No, 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 not, no, no, no. Oh, not a plant incubator. Wait, did it not, did it not, did it stop? Did it not do it? Might have stopped. Okay, I need the plant pot. Farming pot, that. Two, three, four. Okay, three, darn. I can't believe I actually had the stuff for that. <laughs> Hopefully it didn't use the electrical chip. Please don't. Uh, we have four. Yeah, it didn't use it. Okay, good. Hey, look at that. Uh, let's go ahead and get these. Actually, that should be enough for our control center now, right? Seven of those. Printer, farming control panel. Insufficient items. What are we missing? Iron bar, glass crystals, electrical chip. Seven. Glass. Cr ah, we're missing the glass crystals. Okay, let's go grab some more glass crystals. Okay, so now we should be able to make our farming control panel. There we go. 30 seconds to make that. Not bad. Turn that guy on. Okay. So now we're going to see how this whole system actually works. And the whole automation 
purpose of this now i'm curious like once we get this going is it gonna give us like a reason for stuff like oh you need to grow like x amount of like different things or like i'm not sure how this is gonna work i'm curious but i'm not positive okay so let's throw our farming control panel in here control station oh okay water container seeds container oh so this is going to be the um like the the raw output so if i get this and place that there and then these are going to be search container oh okay so now check status turn on to proceed turn on seeds available total stations active stations water amount seeds available carrot cabbage oh okay okay so let's turn this off let's get some water in here and then oh we also need to get our our little plots over here because they're not going to work without it so let's see let's grab that so six so that one let's see that one we have another farming pot so we have to make farming pots for all these but then they're like automated interesting oh this is gonna be cool this is gonna be cool okay so we can go ahead and talk to the commander uh let me go ahead and talk to the commander right now see what see what we get i see that you've built the farming automation system if neil armstrong was the first person who walked on the moon now i can call you neil armstrong the first farmer whoa on the moon. i know you really want to get some automated farming well we have an emergency you might have seen a very Be big base with a locked door near the chinese storage base uh-huh the door to that base also, so, also another emergency, emergency is coming right now meteors an asteroid belt is coming up near the moon it'll start raining down meteors we need to make sure the base doesn't blow up try to reach that try to reach that basis is you can be careful with the meteor showers don't forget to take soap and shampoo i'm kidding but this is really not funny try not to get hit by meteors i'll explain what that base is the purpose of it but first you have to go there and check it out before you leave make sure you packed up on food and water good luck oh there's explosions and stuff going on okay all right all right let's get um let's get some water in here we've got oxygen do we have food we have some carrots we got oxygen we got water okay we got to make our way over there um, yeah, as soon as I started listening to that, I heard explosions, and I was like, oh no, my base is gonna get destroyed. Oh no. Reach the. Oh, it's the power plant. Oh no. Auction level is critical. Okay, hold on. Uh, use that. Use water. Let's go and top off our food, too. Alright, we gotta go. Seriously, don't get hit by a meteor, though. Haha. <laughs> Okay, where's my uh, where's my where's my vehicular? He's over here. Is this does this destroy our base? Like, is that a thing? Where's my rover? Right there. Oh, this is this is cool. Not expecting this. Okay, let's go. So this was that big huge building that was next to that uh, the Chinese storage base. That we're like, oh, I wonder what that is. And yeah. Okay, so we got to get over there. Oh my gosh. There's things everywhere. Like, I don't know how we make sure we don't get hit by these things. So we're just going and hoping for the best. So that's a power plant. Interesting. Oh, hello. I wonder if these are giving us any uh, materials. Doesn't look like it. Looks like they kind of despawn. Oh, this is this is crazy. <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, I saw a shadow of one coming down. Okay, so here's the power plant. Um, there's a big sign there. Okay, let's see what do we got. Nothing in here. I see that you've reached the base. 
Okay. Built by NASA as one of the power plants to provide clean energy to the world. Some time ago, as it was too costly to transfer the energy back to Earth, the plant itself is self-sustaining. But there has been an issue with the main reactor. It seems that they left some sensors in there that were supposed to turn on when it detects a landing on the moon. But the sensors broke, and now they are mistaking asteroids for ships. Oh. The plant was designed to automatically generate enough energy based on how many ships enter the moon. Oh. But they didn't put an upper limit on power generation as they didn't expect a lot of ships to land on the moon at the same time. You can imagine what'll happen if the plant generates energy thinking that every single asteroid is a ship. Now if oh. you in there and turn off the reactor, we'll be by the way. Quick question from me. What does Wayne Johnson become when he lands on the moon? Oh my gosh. A moon rock, okay. of course. So worry about the whole situation. You have to stop it at all costs. I know you're strong as a rock, as a rope moon rock. I won't be able to contact those walls. Well, let's signal through. So you'll be on your own. Okay. Stand near the box to proceed. Blockage found? Oh! Oh, what? This is cool. Uh, can I go forward warrant? Nope. Okay, apparently we can. We have to use this one now. Oh, wait. There's like there's, there's like a puzzle with this. This is kind of neat. So now we shoot. We're gonna have to go across here. Uh, gravity. What? Gravity gun allows you to pick up radioactive cores that can't be held by hand to pick up uh, items. The gravity gun aim at them. And flaps will open the press left mouse button to attach items. Sometimes you might have to hold the left mouse button and wait for the item to attach. Uh, you can press the left mouse button to throw the attached item holding the... Oh, or let go of the item. Okay. Whoa, this is cool. Where's the... Oh, it's right here. Okay, and then gravity gun. So I need this. Oh, this is cool. What? This is super cool. Oh my gosh, this is like a portal kind of thing. Uh. Okay, there's that one. This is really, really cool. Uh-oh. Uh. Okay, what am I supposed to do with this? Am I supposed to just undo these? Wait, what does that want me to do? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. This is like <laughs> moon farming. What? This is completely, oh my gosh. This is super cool. Okay, we did it. Now, do I need to put these back on? No. Okay, so now we can go out here and then maybe this thing down here is done. Okay, so that's gone. So now we need to... What is this? Okay, this takes us up. To 
to right there. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we need one of those crates. Positive, negative, negative, positive. That's like a battery crate. Okay, so that was probably the thing that was right down here, right? What is this? I have no idea, but this is super cool. <laughs> it's very portal-esque. Okay, so now... Uh, I'm gonna guess that maybe this goes... On that platform right there. Like right here. Then we go up. What the heck? Okay, and then this is gonna go right there. It's gonna get materialized right there. Oh! And this is probably just gonna go right here. I imagine this is a battery box. Okay, so there's that. So what is this? Looks like it makes some kind of bridge. Uh, okay, there's these red boxes. Do we do anything with these? I feel like we need to go this way. Can we push these red boxes? Doesn't give me an interact option. What about this? Does this need to go like right here? Huh. Oh! Oh, we can jump way higher. So I can't push these. I feel like if I stand on this, I'm gonna die. Oh! Whoa! Oh! Okay, so we gotta be fast. Oh. We have to have a weight on it. Kind of weird though, because like I don't think these boxes can fit through here. So I'd feel like it has to be one of these boxes. Can we use the gravity gun to pull this? No. Oh wait, huh? <laughs> just jump over it. I'm a dummy. And then what is this? Power core thing? Is it gonna open that door now? Heck yes it will. This is super cool. <laughs> Was not expecting this out of moon farming. All right, let's get some water, hold on. Okay, let's get through here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we need two charges. Here and a fan and like. To get the fan going. You've reached the end of the prologue. What? Oh. I wanted to do some farming. We didn't do any farming. Oh, I wonder if we can do some farming before we get to this point. Huh. I want to see. No, the game automatically saves once you get in here. Oh, I can't leave. I can't leave. Oh, I wanted to do some moon farming. We didn't actually even hardly get any farming done. Oh, this is cool though. This is cool. So I'm I'm just I'm actually like very surprised right now at what what this is cuz like this is not moon farming at all. Well, this is this part's not, but oh, I wanted to get back to the automation and stuff like that. And I wanted to see the systems working. Darn it. And in order for us to do that, I think we'd have to start completely all over from scratch and 
Oh, that took forever to build that base up. Darn, I guess we'll just have to wait until the game is actually out or out of prologue and wait until it gets into hopefully early access at some point. But that's going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you had a good time. I had a good time. I really wanted to get some more planting done, but yeah, well, next time. Next time. Once we get an update, maybe we'll get uh, early access and then we can hop back in and do, do all the planting stuff. But yeah, thank you again for coming out. This is the Moon Farming Prologue. If you're interested, I have a link down below. As always, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe if you think I earned it, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.